What's up everybody? It's Fatty here with a very interesting video for today. Um, so I got a message early this morning, as you can see, it is this image down below, where it seems that Niantic is sort of uh, saying sorry to all the players that it accidentally banned. So in case you're out of the loop, Niantic had accidentally sent out a wave of strikes and punishment to trainers who are pretty much legitimate so undeserved punishments and until recently they haven't really addressed the issue and this has been a long part of a bunch of issues that Niantic has been uh, doing or really just to get under the skin of a lot of players basically for today I'm, I'm happy to say they are finally reimbursing some of those players thankfully i did not get a strike or a false flag you know i didn't i didn't get the accidental ban but a lot of players did and right now niantic is reimbursing them and as you can see below the uh image shows the event box includes a bunch of free passes uh incenses remote passes and 10 incubators which is pretty good in my opinion i know a lot of my subscribers are saying oh my god i wish i got the ban <laughs> or i wish i got the strike so i can get this box honestly i still don't i don't want my account i don't want to have to go through that <laughs> experience but uh without further ado let's just get right into the source here on niantic support twitter we have removed incorrect strikes and punishments for trainers who have received them these trainers will also receive a free event box in the shop we apologize for these errors and working to address this for the future so some a bit of good news right here uh, it seems that niantic isn't just completely going la 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 not listening no it looks like they are responding to a very immediate issue now obviously if we <clears throat> scroll down to the comments below everybody is uh, probably th there are some people who still haven't had this issue uh, resolved but you can see here niantic support is sort of addressing it so they're not just ignoring their players here which is a good step you know uh i would be really angry if my account got banned even though i've never cheated before in my life and I can definitely feel with those players who just woke up one day, looked at their account and saw the ban. Like it just it is really disencouraging to legitimate players. You know, a lot of legitimate players out there. We, we go out of our way to make sure we play this game as intended. We we stay away from the, you know, the cheaters. We don't even interact with them. And a lot of players, especially rural players, you know, it's really tempting for them to cheat, I guess, because they literally have nothing around them, like nothing. Like I've I've played I've been a rural player. I know I know the feeling. Like not having a single stop around you, barely any spawns. It's just awful. Like you just want to enjoy the game, and you can't. But um, at least here, Niantic, at the very least, we'll, I'll give them this. At least they are addressing this very immediate problem. Does this mean they'll address the whole? Uh, Pokestop issue, the, the, the latest uh, update where they're going to be decreasing the distance between Pokestops. I'm not sure about that. Like, I think that is a Niantic core. Um, what's the word for it? I think this is I think this is kind of like something that's really, really important to them. For some reason, they want to increase AR experience by making sure players get really up and close and personal to these focus stops which i still kind of disagree with i think players can still enjoy this game even with the increased distance but i digress at least here there's a bit of good news from niantic they are addressing an immediate issue which in my opinion shouldn't have been a thing to begin with i think they shouldn't i think this shouldn't have been an issue i'm not sure how or why these situations happen or what happens in the coding or whoever did this i don't know maybe it was just an intern that did a mistake i don't know but there's just a bit of good news um 
for us and for all the players who got accidentally banned. And if you did, I am so sorry about that. That is awful experience. But hey, if you did, you are going to get an event box with some really amazing items. So let's see what happens. This is a bit of good news. Maybe this means Niantic will respond to players' other issues. The one that a lot of people are uh, currently boycotting the game over. Um, but hey, a bit of good news here and that's always acceptable. If you have something to say about this, mention in the comments and I will see you in the next video.